You are being watched. You are being watched. The internet surveillance program revealed today the government has a secret system that allows the National Security Agency to tap into the data banks of internet companies in search of foreign terrorists. The machine is everywhere, watching us with 10,000 eyes, listening with a million ears. Does the NSA collect any type of data at all on millions or hundreds of millions of Americans? No, sir. It does not. Not wittingly. The answer to your question is yes. It exists and is watching us right now. There are cases where they could in inadvertently perhaps uh, collect, but not, not wittingly. After the attacks, the government gave itself the power to read every email, listen to every cell phone. The public wanted to be protected. They just didn't want to know how they were being protected. Surveillance takes on its own momentum. It will go forward and forward and forward if somebody doesn't stop it. You can't have 100% security and also then have 100% privacy. We're going to have to make some choices uh, as a society. If I'm right, then someone really built the damn thing. And it's watching us right now. Come give me a hand. Engine's flooded and I can't for the life of me figure out why. I'll be damned. You're not supposed to take things apart like that. You understand, Harold? If they don't want you to get inside, they ought to build it better. You created an intelligence. A life. What I made is just a machine. A system, and that's all. I need you to find Harold for me. Can you track him? You put a bug on your friend? Just his glasses. I can understand why you and Harold get along. Well, unless you got some kind of plan to get me the hell out of here. John. This is the plan. One, two, three, four, five. Break down, baby. <laughs> I got bored sitting in the car. Excuse me, guys. Have you seen a, a little chihuahua? I don't think you're going to be able to simply walk through the front door. Wasn't planning on it. This is fun. This is what you and John do all day long? I'm too wide, big fella. You're a good operator. Sorry, Sean. For Guardian Angels, you two were a bit late to the party. Your employers wanted you dead, so now you are. I'm not that guy anymore. You always told me that if my past came back around, you wouldn't cover for me, and I'm not asking you to. I don't know who you are, Lionel. Come on, Harold. Time to meet God. Where is it? 
You said you wanted to set the machine free. I already did. Why don't we start with the truth? I know you're very smart, um, but I'd love to know what you're really thinking. The truth is, God is 11 years old. That she was born on New Year's Day 2002 in Manhattan. That she is still vulnerable. The truth is that she's chosen me. And I don't know why yet. That for the first time in my life, I'm a little scared about what's going to happen. I said I'd tell you the truth. Didn't say you'd like it. 